Hello everyone, my name is Mr Holston, I'm Head of ICT at Appleton Academy. What I'm going to show you now is how to get to the IDEA award and sign up for an account so that you can start to complete the badges. Um, I'm going to do this first on a mobile phone, so this will work for mobile and tablet, and then I'm going to do it as well on a laptop, so that will work for laptop and PC. So first of all, on your browser, it doesn't matter if you're using Safari on an iPhone or Chrome or any other browser on a phone or tablet, but just search for IDEA award on Google and then the first website brings you in. So because I'm signed in already, I'm just gonna sign it out and start from scratch. So pressing sign up will take you to somewhere where you have a nickname. Now the nickname um, can be anything, but if you have it as a username, so for example, if it was, 11 student, obviously yours would be 11, and then your first initial and surname. Date of birth, just change that to what it needs to be, whatever it is. And email, if you put in your parents' email, um, and if they don't have an email address, you can use idea at appletonacademy.co.uk. The reason that you need to put this address in is just in case you forget your username or password so it can get sent to that address. The password, there is some rules here. It needs to be eight characters long and use a symbol and a number. Now that's a good idea for any password. So if you remember this password, you can use it as your school password as well. So I'm just gonna put in a password of Appleton one and then an exclamation mark so that it has a number and a symbol. And then do the same thing again. Then don't forget to tick I agree to the terms and the privacy and then press sign up. Because you're under 13, like I say, you just need to name the parent and guardian and add their email address. And I'm just going to put my own name as that one. school email address. So now that that's complete, it will take you to a tutorial page. So if you watch the tutorial, it will talk you through the badges and how they all work. Um, once you've done that, if you go up to edit profile, then you can see all the details again. You can set the UK and at the bottom it says organize a code. Now, if you add the code AA year seven, if you're in year seven, then that means that we can see your progress and sort of give you a hand and it'll be useful if you want to come to the idea club if you're in year eight nine then you just need to change that to say aa year eight and aa year nine so that's double a then year and the number so apart from that the award itself is broken down into bronze and silver and we're going to do bronze a lot of it's going to be done uh, as homework so i'm going to show you now on the screen um, which badges you should do and which ones you shouldn't. So in the citizen section, the badges that we're gonna cover are teamwork, social media ethics, what is the cloud, safe online, e-safety and digital ethics. So that means that you shouldn't really be doing those badges in your own time as they'll make more sense to be done as homework in between the lessons. The other badges, GDPR, cyber spies, cyber security, social media setup, fake news, internet and web, global goals, data play, brain hack, e-commerce, personal statement and farm tech are all available to do now. So you can do those um, anytime up until the end of year nine, but there's no uh, harm in starting them now. So back to the uh, mobile version. And you've got the achievements that you've done so far and which badges you've done. So once you start doing one of these badges, for example, idea, what is the cloud? It will tell you at the bottom that you can start the badge and what it's related to. And then there are other citizen badges too. So these all need to be completed. But like I say, the ones that I mentioned earlier, uh, leave them for now because we'll do those when the lessons come up. So. Now I'm going to switch and do exactly the same thing on 
uh, on a laptop. So with a laptop, you just need to start um, the same way, go to Google. And once you're on Google, just type in idea or idea reward like this. And then you'll come to the website. Okay, again, the sign up screen's up here and it looks familiar to the mobile version. And there's no problem if you do some of it on a laptop and some of it on a phone, it's all the same account. Okay, so I'm gonna do the same thing again. Um, this time I've got some details in already of a student that I've already created. But again, you just need to have your nickname as whatever your school username is, first initial and surname. Set the date of birth and put the password in twice. Remember that the password must have at least eight characters with one symbol and one number. For example, Appleton one exclamation mark. Put that in again and then sign up. Because this account's already created, I'm just gonna sign in. Again, there's a tutorial here and you can watch that and it talks you through what all the badges do and how to progress through them. And then once you've done that, you can see the four sections below with the badges that need to be done. So similar to the phone, um, some of the badges we're gonna do in lessons. Um, and I'm gonna show you again, a full list of those. So for the citizen category, don't do teamwork, social media ethics, safe online, what is the cloud, e-safety and digital ethics, because we're gonna uh, cover those in lessons. For worker, don't do projects or random coding, digital research or collaboration, design psychology, colors or internet of things, because we're gonna cover those in lesson. Uh, gift making, graphic design, coding solutions, making websites, junior web designer, video editing and animation and for entrepreneur, just innovation. So any of the badges that aren't highlighted, you can do those in any order in your own time between now and year nine. Um, it's also worth mentioning that sometimes these are in a slightly different order, so pay attention to the names of the badges rather than what position they're in. Um, and that's about it. So good luck with getting logged in and um, starting on some of these badges. And then like I say, the idea is by the end of year nine, Everyone has passed this idea award and that'll give you an extra qualification to put on your CV for uh, sixth form college or apprenticeship applications.